Barbara, Eden Capwell is a rich girl who's found her paradise in the arms of police detective Cruz Castillo. Marcy Walker is Eden. Cruz is played by A, that's his nickname, folks, Martinez. And what a pair they make. I'll try to stay out of your life. It's not going to be easy to try to make a life without you. But I'm going to try. You can be happy without me, Eden. I know you can. You have a lot. You deserve to be happy. I want you to be. Thank you. Whether they're laughing or fighting, torn apart or tenderly reunited, there's always a special magic between these two dynamite performers. You would never do what wasn't right. So I fell in love with you. I would tell you why I fell in love with you. I'd tell you all the reasons. Except I can't count that high. Uh, what, what makes uh, Cruz and Eden work is the fact that Marcy and uh, me really uh, hit it off great. Um, we, we created a backstory. Basically, she came up with the idea of what our, uh, our history had been. And we created a little world for ourselves that, um, that was a bit beyond what was written on the page. And uh, the audience uh, bought it. Um, it would be a shame if, if uh, relationships on soaps, love couples, love relationships on soaps, were only created by the writer. They didn't, they, they told us, they said, we said to them, we went to them and said, this is working. You know it's working. We were doing all these wonderful scenes, you know, that they put it together because they wanted us to hate each other. And we totally turned it around because that's not the way we wanted to do it. And we worked so well together. <laughs> and they said, this is working. They said, we will not put you two together. You're a wasp. He's Mexican. We won't do it. We don't know what the public will think. I said, it works. They love it. They love it. Do it. it it's not that, you know, we, as actors, we just do something and they pick up on it. They were so unaware that what we were doing, that by the time, I mean, we had been doing it for six months yeah. before they realized that we had created a love couple. And then they started writing for us. How does it feel to play star-crossed lovers from opposite sides of the tracks? We have like a, a bit of an unspoken communication about a lot of things uh, as Cruz and Eden that, uh, that supports us all the time. We're just really lucky in that respect. Um, because any kind of love relationship, when you're playing a love relationship and you're having to play bed scenes and love scenes and sexuality and being turned on by someone, that's all sexual. So you have to take the emotional value out of it, I think and look at it from terms of, you know, we're friends, and I are friends, and I trust him, and he trusts me, and I would never do anything to, um, to make it a non-respectful relationship. And we just know that, and it's just all above, above board. So we have the freedom to express the emotions and the sexuality and know it's not going anywhere. The one thing I gotta say I hate are these bodysuits you have to wear, because it's like a bathing suit, you know? But they're the kind that come to here, and you, you always feel like it's going to slip down. Oh, it's like cool if I get in too close, I got this big cauliflower <laughs> shadow on his face, you know, and I'm going to be really terrible. So it's like, oh, Cruz, I love you so much. in the afternoon isn't very physical at all. It's the emotions, the looks, the sighs, the romance. And isn't that what we really all ache for in our own lives? To make every moment magic. It's that elusive thing called chemistry. Yeah. yeah, I like, like you. Like you like me? Yeah, I like you. <laughs> <laughs> I know some people, as a matter of fact, who do not like each other at all, who are very hot love couples. I don't know how they do it. <laughs> I don't either. <laughs> because it's, it's, you're working together. I mean, you're in a, in a it's, it's stressful. I mean, you know. I think the audience can really tell. Yeah, me too. Really tell. They're a lot smarter than people give them credit for. They can tell if you like each other or if you don't. I mean, in the eyes, you can always see there's something there. It's that one that's different than all the rest, for it can never end in heartbreak or rejection or despair. It's that very special bond between the soap stars on screen and you. You may not realize it, but you're a very important part of our lives. Uh, more than any other 
kind of job an actor can get a hold of, uh, being on a soap puts you into a relationship with an audience. Genuine respect that the actors have for the people who, who care about actors and about love relationships and couples and soap operas. Um, it's really a one in a million when you feel um, the magic that you do being a working actor and being appreciated. And I know we feel it back, so it's just, um, it's neat.